Hi everyone. Today we're going to be talking about Pacific Biosciences of California, specifically who they are, what they do, and why Kathy Wood has made them the number one holding in the ARK Invest Genomic Revolution ETF. Let's dive in. This is the PacBio SQL2 system, and it allows scientists to sequence DNA at a much cheaper cost than ever before. And this is going to help scientists resolve genetically complex problems. It's going to play a major role in gene editing, which will potentially help scientists cure many, if not all, disease. Now, this machine allows PacBio to sequence the human genome for less than $1,000, a process that used to cost over $100,000. And if Moore's law holds true, the cost should get below $100 in the near future. This is a major reason why PacBio is at the forefront of the genomic revolution. It's also why PacBio should see some of the fastest exponential growth we have ever seen in the stock market. We're going to take a look at PacBio's stock price in just a moment. But first, let's hear why Kathy Wood thinks the genomic marketplace is poised for a massive breakout over the next five years. Which of your current holdings, Kathy, do you think will supply the biggest lift in the next five years? Tesla's still in the running, but I would have to say the biggest upside surprises are going to come from the genomic space. Uh, and that's because the convergence of DNA sequencing, uh, artificial intelligence, and gene therapies, importantly, CRISPR gene editing, are going to uh, cure disease. That convergence is going to cure disease. Now we have real science and technology surfacing the mutations in our genomic profile. And, um, and uh, as they surface those mutations, what do we see? We see the earliest manifestations of disease. And now, with the combination of artificial intelligence and gene editing, we're able to both anticipate diseases and cure them, potentially. Beta thalassemia, we're seeing it, sickle cell disease. We even think it will work in uh, diabetes, which is where most uh, the, the if you look at the largest category of spending uh, year to year in healthcare, it's diabetes. So as Kathy Wood mentioned, the largest category of spending in all of healthcare is diabetes. And there is a chance we are going to be able to cure diabetes by editing a person's genes. But in order to edit a person's genes using CRISPR and Cas9, you first need to sequence their genome. And you do that with the PacBio SQL2 system. So as we move into this world of potentially curing all disease with gene editing, PacBio's tool for sequencing the human genome is going to play a major role. And this means they are potentially going to make a lot of money. Let's take a look now at how the stock price is currently doing. PacBio's current stock price is $37.05. That's an increase of 651% over the past year. And if you go back to August, so five months ago, the stock price was only about $5 per share, representing an increase of 638%. So if you invested $1,000 in PacBio in August of 2020, five months later, in January of 2021, your stock would be worth $6,380. So even though the stock price has already increased dramatically, I believe there is still a lot of runway remaining for it to go up. ARK Invest believes this too. I think we could see this stock 10X or even 20X over the next five years. And as we sit at the forefront of the genomic revolution, PacBio stands to benefit tremendously from the rapid advancements in gene editing technology. This presents a massive opportunity for investors who are willing to support innovative companies like PacBio that have a good chance to change the world and dramatically decrease suffering caused by disease. In our next video, 
we are going to cover CRISPR therapeutics and the role they will play in the gene editing market. What do you think of the genomic revolution? Is PacBio a good investment? Let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to like and subscribe. Also, please remember, this video is only for educational purposes and is not investment advice. Please make sure to do your own due diligence before deciding to invest. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.